I'm back with another quick tutorial for Dark Souls. This time it's how to do the consistent method of True Asylum Skip. So for the first thing you're going to want to do is make your way to the Fall Gate, clearing out the three nearby enemies, then walk right into the corner here, drop an item, doesn't matter what item you drop, and line up the camera in a specific way. So we press down on the camera so it's all the way down and then move it so the top left of the souls box is lined up with this line right here. Doesn't have to be super perfect, just in that general area. Now we need to tap W on the keyboard to get our character to turn without moving, which can be tricky. There we go. And then we need to press A on our controller to walk through the fog gate, and exactly one frame later, press E on the keyboard to pick up the item. If done right, you'll end up walking through the fog gate at a weird angle and end up inside the wall. And I didn't get that part right. Alright, let's try this again. Third time's the charm. So now we're going to walk into the wall. When you see your character go a decent distance above that flat piece, start running, turn, and jump. And you should go straight over the fence. It is possible to do the jump a little bit earlier than I did there, but it's risky because if you mess it up, then you have to do the whole thing again. But that is how to do true asylum skip with the consistent method. Anyway, I hope this video helped, and I will see you guys in another video.